Chantel here. If you're brand new here, then welcome to my new fashion, beauty, lifestyle, and wellness videos on this channel. And if you're a subscriber and you keep coming back, then thank you. I really do appreciate every single one of you. In today's video, guys, we are gonna do a little show and tell. I recently went to Primark and couldn't resist buying the Primark Times Rita Aura collection and getting a few pieces from that. I couldn't resist. I tried so hard to walk past it, but to be honest, the collection's dope. It's really, really good, really affordable, great quality, and Rita Aura has done an amazing job. So, well done, Rita. On top of that, there's a few extra bits that I've picked up from other stores. And I thought, why not just throw it into a little haul and show you what I bought recently. Um, some things are beauty, some are shoes, some are clothing, and some extra bits from Primark outside of the Rita Aura collection. So if you wanna find out more of what I've picked up from Primark, then keep watching. So my loves, I have two Primark bags. Please don't be like shocked by the fact that I really didn't want to spend a lot of money and I don't think I really did. I really was selective on what I picked up but I think I put the best from the collection. So let me just take you through what I got. So let's jump straight in. Nothing beats a simple white shirt. And I really wanted to show you them with the tag still on, so none of it's been worn yet. So I will try them out at some point and probably shoot them outside but until then, this is just a show and tell of what I picked up recently and let you know the prices and stuff like that. So these things are all currently available in Primark right now. Nothing beats a nice shirt dress. I put a shirt dress, I think it's just a long shirt, let's just be real. But the way I'd wear it is in like a dress fashion with knee high boots and a nice jacket. And it's just, I love the pocket details. I really love the two pockets. What you tend to find is these shirts have one pocket, but this one has two. So that's a big, big plus and I love the length of it. It comes just down below the knee and it's just amazing. Teamed with long knees, like knee high boots, it's gonna be epic. A um, really good quality. I checked the stitching and so forth. I was definitely left impressed with that. Um, and the price of this shirt was 16 pounds and I got it in a 12 to 14. I have a 36 D and some people have much bigger bust, but for me, that's big enough. And I often find that if I don't get a 12, there's a gate in my tops, shirts and so forth. So I definitely size up to a 12 to 14, just to ensure I have enough space in it. But yeah, absolutely long, love this classic shirt. Next up, right, let me just tell you a little backstory about this item, yeah? There was a woman in the store with me and we both wanted this item. We both wanted it, we both saw it, it was the last one. It's in a size 10, this is not my usual size, I don't normally wear size 10, but it was available, I had to grab it, and then I had that whole thing afterwards of will it fit me? Well, it does fit, I did try this on, I must say, there was a little cheating going on, but I wanted to make sure I could keep it, and I definitely can, and that is this amazing denim coals. So we've got this lovely acid wash black denim jacket, Gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. Black zips, so black um, detailing zips. Um, no buttons, it just zips up. I got it in a size 10 to 12. It was 24 pounds and obviously it could be worn as a jacket on its own, like, you know, with jeans, with leggings, crop top, jumper, you know, it's, it's the options are open. And I just love how it fits. It does fit snug, but that is a 10 to 12 aspect of it. But I don't see anybody else really pushing it online, so I'm really happy I managed to put my hand on the last one in this Primark store that I went to, and it's just gorgeous. I got this. Right, so next up, matching skirt. So it's another washed, um, literally acid black, denim skirt. I absolutely love everything about it. I love the zip and the way that it's at a slant. There's a zip detailing here. And I think, can you put something in it? No, the zip is just a design, but I absolutely love the zips. Um, again, a size 10 was a tricky one. It was a bit of a, you know, a, a gamble, but I had to do the gamble because I really wanted the set. I've got some ideas of where I'm gonna wear it to, and that's an absolute must. So yeah, there we have it. Absolutely love, love, love this. Um, and then the set together, like guys, honestly, I could just wear it with a crop top underneath, knee high boots, or nice sandals, like it's still sandal weather. It is nearly October and it's boiling hot outside. I'm burning up. I've literally just come from work and I've stripped off and put on this because I just couldn't cope trying to film it with my work shirt on. I started filming, 
with my work shirt on and then I had to take it off because of the sheer fact of how hot it is. So yeah, there's still ample opportunity to wear these two and I absolutely love them. So we got that. Price points are fantastic. Material's great as well. So next up I've got the tie-dye. Tie-dye is so very much in for me. I love tie-dye still. Absolutely love tie-dye. Um, this was eight pounds, got it in size 12 to 14. I wanted a bit of space in this. The fact that it's long sleeve means that it's perfect for that transitional weather into autumn, winter. And again, it's just so stand out. It's, it's really bold. It's really out there. On my blog, sashachantel.com, we'll do a little plug. I have a current post on there about wearing bold prints and different types of like bold colors, stepping out of the black realm and just trying new things. And obviously like tie dye is very outside of like normal. It's very out there. It's very, um, it's very standout basically tie dye. And there's so much different color tie dye variations, but I love this one. It's a bit moody. It comes up really bright on the camera, but it literally is a white and dark blue. So it really gives an idea of like goth, but I love it. I can really see myself wearing it in different ways, but I'm really like leaning towards a leather skirt so yeah so that was as i mentioned before if you missed it that was eight pounds really good bargain that one and then i've got some accessories but it's important to add the accessories into this haul as well so for three pound fifty they come in one size and they're called color yellow and they are from the autumn winter 23 collection i've got the rita aura times primark gold glasses i mean glasses um earrings and they're just they really give the air of like expense. They look they cost a lot of money and they, they, they're really heavy, which is really good. Obviously, they put that weight on your ears. But outside of that fact, they just really look like they're really high fashion and they're top quality. So I'm really happy with this. And on top of that, they're made using a minimum of 50% recycled metal. And I love that too. So better for the environment. So yeah, I've got these earrings for £3.50. Now, steering a little way from away from the Primark and Rita Ora collection, I need a new night dress. I don't know about you guys, like, you know you have the you have the intention to wear really nice stuff to bed, but as the time goes on, you just end up going into t-shirt and a, and a and a vest and shorts, like something really basic and like nothing fancy. So I thought I'd try and steer back to dressing up a bit better for bed again, but I didn't want to go too deep. We've got to keep it comfortable, right? Now already this purple is popping on the screen. I can see it's popping. It's a gorgeous, gorgeous color lilac. And it's got a lace trim at the top and at the back. And the material is so soft. It's gonna like literally float all over my skin. It's gonna be so nice. And it was eight pounds. And yeah, it's purple in the medium, 12 to 14. I wanted the space. I wanted something that's really like airy. It's getting a bit chilly at nighttime, but a dressing gown covering it would just do the trick. But again, really nice, simple. As I say, like a cami or a chemise. Um, give me the right name for this, guys, but I absolutely love it. And I really needed one, so that was a great extra piece on the collection. I've got an umbrella, but that's not even important. I've got some Primark chewing gum, but that is not even a thing right now either. So that's the first thing. But also, there's a little thing here to show you, but I'm gonna show you after. I'm gonna show you the additional things I've got in the month after, and just keep the focus on the Primark stuff first. So I then got, oh yes, here's the umbrella. The day that I went to Primark, it was a few days ago, it was peeing down with rain. Like it was so heavy, like a torrential type of rain, like a tropical storm. And I had an umbrella, but it was breaking. So I thought, let me buy a new one. And I absolutely love this umbrella. The zebra print is so cool. And it's really sturdy and it really like, when I opened it up, I felt, yeah, I'm gonna be all right. And I definitely was. So there's that. Um, okay, next. So next up, this was causing quite a, like a big furor online when I saw it. The Rio Oil collection, there was these patterned tights leggings. So like a lace effect legging. And honestly, I, on, I, this could be the best part of the collection. I have tried it on, and the reason why I tried it on is because I got it in a 14 to 16 era. Yeah, so in that rush to get it, because there was not many left, and all the women were in Primark like, 
going mad through the shelves, like pulling it all off, and I thought, nah, I'm gonna get one. I am leaving here with one, yeah? So I got it in large. So a 14 to 16. I didn't realize that a 14 to 16 in UK is a 10 to 12 in the US, but anyway, 14 to 16 in UK. It's 12 pounds, great bargain. And even though I got it too big in that big furore and rush, it still fits okay. So I can wear this with the gray shirt. I mean, with the white shirt, it's gonna look so dope. I've got an event coming up soon and I might wear that, but I'm still like toying on the idea of something different, but it's just so different. It's such a great addition to the collection and Rita just went all in and I just love what she, her style and the way that she dresses. Like it's really up my street. So yeah, they look like sexy lace underwear, but again, they are actually leggings. So yeah, I think, I think most people who went and got the collection bought this and it was definitely a must and it wouldn't feel right if I didn't get these. So I'm happy that I didn't have to rush to another Primark store to get them. I got it all in one place. So that was fantastic. Another accessory from the collection, I got a gold pair, so I thought I'd get a silver pair. And can you see them? Can you see them? Just a really nice, it's that whole trinkety kind of feeling, um, but it reminds me of Christmas. Christmas is around the corner again. It's coming up thick and fast, like it's around the corner, and I'm pretty excited about Christmas. So, um, these, I think I'll be wearing them Christmas day. They give that kind of air of like Christmas and celebration. They're really pretty, really intricate and a nice quality. And they were only four pounds. So yeah, absolutely love those. Great addition to the collection. And that's what I picked up from the Rita Aura collection. So yeah, those four pieces, very happy with what I got. Absolutely love them, but I didn't stop there in Primark. Had a little gander, had a little walk around and I bought a few more things. So let's step into this awesome pink diary. I'm a diary mad woman. I love diaries. I love organizers. I love getting as many diaries and organizers as possible. And I couldn't resist this one I love. So look at it. It doesn't come with a pen, but it's got the pen holder. And then it's got, now this was, I think it was six pounds, yeah? Six or seven pounds, wait, six pounds. The best six pounds I have spent in a long time. There's so much inserts and Primark actually sell additional inserts. So it's just gonna motivate that businesswoman in me, I feel. And I really feel like stationary always make me feel like I'm leveling up a bit. Seems crazy, you might, if that's you, just comment below, but I love new stationery. And if I've got a new goal in place, I like to get a new diary to like coincide with the visions I have. All very crazy, but it works for Sasha. I'm very, very wacky sometimes. So yeah, it's called a pocket diary, but this ain't fitting in no one's pocket, let's be real. <laughs> but it's so cute, so nice. I did originally see it in black and I should have bought it when I saw it from the first time, but I didn't. So pink was all that was left, but you know what? It's a good compromise. So yeah, I got this organizer. I got this nice, I've got this already. It's a bodysuit. I've got it in small this time, so it's a 10 to 12 and it was seven pounds. I've got it in grey already, I've got it in black already, but the black comes starting like to bauble, but I did have it for a number of months. Like it wasn't like a short term thing. I had, it, I had it for quite a while, but I just love the quality of it and I love how it feels. And when you have it on and like with trousers and that, you do feel quite nice. Like it's not a level down, it's definitely a level up. The quality is nice, it, it's, it holds you in like a shapewear would. And it just, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous bodysuit. Really plain and simple, but it does the job. So I picked up another one of these. As we are hitting that cold weather phase, we haven't reached it just yet. Jumpers are always something I reach for and I need more jumper dresses. Not that I have the space for them. And that's where my vintage comes in. So I'm linking my vintage down below because I will be putting some of the stuff I don't want on there. But what I did want, was this lovely, rich, orange jumper dress. I, I, I call it a jumper dress, it could be a long jumper, but either way, this, my loves, this jumper dress, look at it, look at it. Stunning, absolutely stunning. I love it, the quality, the feel, the softness, the roller neck detail, it gives them autumn vibes, you know, the auburn, 
that autumn leaves like it does it gives that vibe completely and i'm so ready for the jumper dress the knee high boots the beret and the jacket i am like sitting in that space waiting for that time to come and i just love it so this was 20 pounds quite pricey i must say i wasn't that impressed with the price i wasn't like happy with paying that amount but hey hey ho that's how it goes um 12 to 14 i got it in and it's down as red but there's nothing red about this like let's just be real is this not burnt orange like in the comments please help you help the girl is this not a burnt orange jumper because i say it is it's gorgeous let me just stand with it and just show you absolutely amazing burnt orange had to have it love it in love in love and then i'm nearly done so the last thing i got yep the last thought from primark is this now this is like this was bought with work in mind i commute a lot for work now and i'm either driving or on public transport or i walk a lot too and i just thought i want to look smart but be warm and the combination of the shirt jumper like outfit where it's stitched in is like one of the best things for work do you know how good you feel in these outfits like i always feel like i look a million bucks with these on no no word of a lie i absolutely love 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 them so this yeah i'm here for it absolutely here for it and um yeah i love it i got it in a 10 10 to 12. i had they had it in blue and black but i decided to step out of that space and get the beige and that was a good choice because i feel like it's very sophisticated and again it's not only for work this can be worn in different places i imagine going out for lunch or dinner and wearing this but it's just gorgeous and um yeah a must an absolute must one of the best things i bought from primark really good quality and it was 19 pounds and that's all the primark stuff so that's the retail aura times primark and the general primark stuff that i bought over the last week or so so outside of that there was a few other purchases that i made that i wanted to show off to you guys today so first things first is this really lovely quality um like a stretch polyester really bold royal blue is it is it a royal blue a very cobalt blue um tracksuit from shein and I was saying that I'm not going to talk about Shein no more because Shein don't work with smaller influencers at all and I was on Instagram the other day and there was a conversation about this where no matter how good the quality your your um your work is the, the things that you put out on your Instagram your content they just say no you ain't got 10,000 followers you ain't got 20,000 followers you ain't got 400 likes we don't want to work with you and it's just the way they disregard their consumer who actually advocates and buys their stuff wears it and tags them and they ignore you i think it's such a dreadful way to behave as a brand so as much as i do have them on here i do not shoot them for my instagram anymore so i don't like put them up and tag them anymore because they're just not going to get my tags any longer um but i just love how rich blue this is on the camera look how strong this blue is like it's popping right now so um i love the blue and if you agree if you're an influencer and you're watching this video like primark i mean sorry she you need to do better guys because you just mm -mm -mm, it's not happening so got that but it's just a nice quality when i worked in a nail shop the other day i got a lot of compliments my mom absolutely loved it and it's just a gorgeous shade of, of blue absolutely stunning and it looks really good on my skin so yeah and then i'll save these two to last because they're actually quite exciting um so i have an event coming up and i wanted some shoes for it and i'm really like feeling anxious about what shoes i'm wearing because i don't want my feet to hurt I have tried it on, there's a slight pain, and I'm thinking, hmm, but I don't really return things. Sasha does not return, I just sell on. So if I don't like it, I sell it. I'm not saying I'm selling these, but that's what tends to happen if I don't feel comfortable or I don't like something anymore. But I recently picked up. Okay. So before I was really interrupted, <laughs> I recently got these very strange heels 
from Shein. They're so cool. I love that pointed detail here and I love that bit here. And I just, I reached to Shein because they're really affordable and I find the quality works for me. And it's like, it fits my price point and it's not too expensive, but it's got that extra pizzazz. But I just do not advertise their things like that anymore. I just wear it for my own self. And I, I buy less and less from them now, but I really did like those heels. And I feel like it could be a good option for a party piece, but I'm still deciding on it. But yeah, so let me show you one more time. And the best part is that chain detail that goes around the back like that is sexy as hell right so they're very different it's the whole pointy front the perspex heel bit and then the extra um chain detail there's a lot going on but that's why i liked it so yeah so i ordered them and i've got those and here's this exciting bit so i went to costco and i'm quite a late bloomer to costco right i'm a late bloomer and my boyfriend Let's just say we went on a date night because we went to Costco and then we went to, cin it went to Chinese to eat and then we went to cinema. So it was like a packed evening. But at Costco, I saw the Maybelline um, Lift the Gloss with Hy Hyaluronic Acid and it makes lips look filler, fuller with no filler. First of all, let me just put a disclaimer, I don't have small lips and I love my lips already, but I just like how glossy they are. I love how glossy they look <laughs> like, <laughs> and I love a good lip gloss and I love lip gloss to be really like moisturizing and I've heard a lot about this lip gloss like so much so I wanted to get it and I got three in the packet and I think it cost 17 pounds for all three now individually in like super dogs or boots that would be a hell of a lot of money so to get all three for that price was fantastic so if you're ever in Costco and you want to get some new lip balm or lip gloss head over there to the beauty section and get these because I'm telling you, I probably will do a review on them very soon because I haven't opened them. I've been holding on to them like a proper manic person, but um, they just look really cool. So I got those. Last thing I got was, I've never heard of Lapcos, but they've got it's Lapcos 10 sheet masks variety set for ultimate radiance and hydration. So in there it has, Lapcos Daily Skin Mask Fighter C. So I guess that's the orange one. Okay, so that's the packet. My ring light's like bouncing off it, but that's that. Then it's got the Lip Lapcos Daily Skin Mask Milk, and I believe that could be the purple one. I'm not sure. There's other colours in there, but that's got one piece. And there's a bit of has three, and then the Lapcos Daily Skin Mask Honey. Oh my God. That has one piece. Then we have the Lacoste Daily Skin Mask Charcoal, which is great for when you have spot prone skin. Reach for the charcoal mask, it does work, honestly. Um, and there's one of those. And I've got the Lacoste Daily Skin Mask Aloe. And that's here in the front. And there are, there's one of those. And then I have the Lacoste Daily Skin Mask Collagen. Ah! So this costs about 18 99 that's a, it's a big spend. And I've been spending a bit too much recently, so I am gonna ease back but I just felt really excited about the skincare aspect of this and giving myself some pamper days. And this is just right up my street. So that was in Costco as well. And I'm really excited to actually use this. I've never heard of Lapcos before. So if you have guys, please leave some comments in below and just let me know what Lapcos is about. Is it good? Was it a worthy investment? And I'll probably do some face mask reviews of this for a beauty video. So watch this space. And my loves, that is it. That is everything I bought my little shopping haul recently. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you enjoyed it, as you know, Primark, you cannot link them online because they don't sell online yet. But all these things that I have bought are recent. They're currently in the Primark stores. Every store is different, but I would like to think you will find the majority of what I've showed you in this video there. And the other items, I will send links and put links on them so you can check them out because they're absolutely dope. So guys i absolutely love you thank you so much for watching my video i hope you enjoyed it and i will see you in my next one okay guys take care and talk soon bye